Yo, what's going on guys? Arix here and today is another exciting day. You guys should know by now, I'm a massive Zelda fan. Zelda is my number one, number one favorite franchise. And today is the launch of the Legend of Zelda Game & Watch. I want to give a massive shout out to Nintendo who very kindly sent this one to me. However, I have got a giveaway for you guys. We are also going to be giving you a chance to win one of these. If you guys want a chance to enter, there is a link in the description box down below. You can click that and I'll also recap some details at the end of this video. But basically, I want to open this thing. I want to take a quick look at it, see what it has available. Honestly, I just wanted this more so as a collector, but it is really cool because it gives you a chance to go back and replay a few of the classics. So if you guys do enjoy this video, then a like would be super appreciated. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys are going to be picking one of these up yourself. And of course, if you have been enjoying the content lately, don't forget to subscribe. But to begin with, of course, taking a look at the outside of the box, you have, uh, you know, this very sort of nice golden look to it. Of course, you have the original Zelda right bang smack in the middle. We have this nice plastic sleeve, which of course you can then slide off. But I just really like the look of it. I like the gold, of course, very Zelda. I like the little details. And of course, if you take a look on the back, it lists the available game. Games. So we have the original Legend of Zelda, we have Zelda 2 The Adventure of Link, we have one of my personal favourites which is The Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening, that is one of my favourite Zelda games, not number one, but it is up there as one of my favourite titles, so I'm super happy that one is on here. But, of course, because of the Game & Watch, you also have a few additional things as well. You have the Game & Watch game itself, where you basically play as Link and you have to kind of whack them all these items that are sort of coming up and down. There is also the sort of playtime clock, so you can explore the world whilst, of course, having a clock, you know, on your desk. And there is also a sort of playtime timer as well, so you can basically set a timer, think of it like a stopwatch, but you can also play the game as well. But, if we take a look inside it, of course, open up the box, you have all the usual stuff, you have the, uh, you know, manual, how to use it, kind of stuff like that. Honestly, I don't need to know how to use it. There are very few buttons on this thing. If I didn't know how to use it, then I probably would need some help. That aside, it also comes in this rather interesting cardboard stand, which uh, not only is cool packaging, you of course have the Triforce over the left, but if you turn it over on the back, there are actually some legs that you can then turn this into a stand. So if you want to actually have it stand up on its own as like a clock or anything like that, you can do so. And then you can just leave it idle in there. But of course, taking a look at the device itself, Again, really nice. You've kind of got that iconic green border around it, the nice sort of golden color reminiscent of uh, some of those golden cartridges. And of course, then when you press the power button, turn it on, you are greeted by nothing but nostalgia. Of course, to begin with, you can of course press the time button to set the clock and you can then start roaming the open world, kind of just exploring the original Zelda alongside the fact that there is a clock there as well. But if you press the game button, you can then turn your attention to the different array of titles. And again, not only can you play them, you know, in English, but of course they do also have Japanese and sometimes additional languages as well. So you can scroll through those and select the different options. I kind of like the sort of timer stuff as well, which because of, of course, you've kind of got that fun like mini game you can play alongside it. And of course, once you finish it, you do get this epic little animation. So this is definitely super cool. But for the time being, that is pretty much it. Just a super quick video. Just wanted to give you guys a chance to take a look at it and just sort of see the unboxing experience. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Again, if you guys want a chance to win one, then uh, I'm giving you guys a chance. The link is in the description box down below. Simply click that, go over there, check all the entries, and then you'll be in with a chance to win. The winner will then be drawn next week and will be announced over on my Twitter. I will also try to remember to pin a comment on this YouTube video so you also know who won. But basically, make sure you're on Twitter because that's the easiest way to kind of communicate with people when they win. But anyway, that's it for the time being. Just a super quick look at the Legend of Zelda Game & Watch. Hope you guys enjoyed that. If you have any questions, by all means let me know in the comments down below. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you want to catch more from us, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss our latest uploads. And if you want somewhere to hang out, play games, or chat all things from games to anime, food to fitness, consider joining the Arix Gaming Discord.